Takum just tak Miki Gravel mogo. Kaci czuwaj za odonga. Tonga i tuam dzidzi ju malit pa anginko tu. Tolba da bunk walia gando de nago czuczut. Takum just tak Miki Gravel mogo. Kaci czuwaj za odonga. Tolba da bunk walia gando de nago czuczut. Tonga i tuam dzidzi ju malit pa anginko tu. Bada bunk walia gando de nago czuczut. Tonga i tuam dzidzi ju malit pa anginko tu. Tolba da bunk walia gando de nago czuczut. Rundi ha donga ku hunga bi. Wana kun bes. Kaci ju ai tha ha donga. In kin kuno ba muli ra chik kun. Ta kum jus tak miki grabal mogo. Kaci ju ai tha ha donga, tolpa da bonk mualia gando da nago chuchut. Rundi ha donga ku hunga bi, wana kun bes. Tong hai tuam jiji ju malith pa ang inko tu. Tolpa da bonk mualia gando da nago chuchut. Kaci ju ai tha ha donga, in kin kuno ba muli ra chik kun. Takum just tak Miki Gravel mogo. Kaci ju ai tha ha donga. Tong hai tuam jiji ju malit pa ang inko tu. Tolba da bunk walia gando de nago chuchut.
Have you managed to retrieve the data from our droid in the Sith base? Excellent. It does not appear to have been tampered with, so the Sith did not manage to copy its contents yet. And now for your information. We are not supposed to speak of this, but since you are a Jedi and we have exhausted all the other options, I think I can entrust you with this. As you know, the Republic is fighting for its very existence against the evil of the Sith Empire. As you also undoubtedly know, we're doing very poorly. We need much in the way of supplies and material to stem the tide of battle and bring us victory. Manan is the sole source of Kolto, the most powerful medical substance in the galaxy. Frankly, we need as much of it as we can get. The Selkath conservatives, with their neutrality treaties, seek to treat the Sith and the Republic equally. This includes Kolto exports. But a few more far-sighted Selkath see that if the Sith are ever allowed to win, the galaxy will be plunged into darkness, and there would be nothing to stop them from taking Manan anyway. So we made a deal. Shh! Not so loud. Yes, it is a technical violation of the treaty, but it is sanctioned by elements of the Selkath government. We need only to keep it hidden from the Sith. We recently began construction of a secret underground facility to harvest Kolto directly at its source. We also hope to one day be able to synthesize it effectively. Current techniques are insufficient for the task, so we must mine it for now. The amount we take would hardly be noticed, since most is lost naturally before it reaches the surface anyway. We were nearing completion of the base when the digging teams reported some sort of obstruction, um, an ancient building or artifact, possibly your star map. Transmissions from the base were cut off abruptly after that, and we haven't heard from the station since. As you may have noticed, we're hiring a lot of mercenaries around here. Ostensibly, they're to be shipped off-world to aid in our fight against the Sith, but they're really for another purpose. When we lost contact with the station in the Rackard Rift, we sent our contingent of Republic soldiers down to investigate. None returned. We've tried hiring mercenaries and sending them down as well, but none of those expeditions have returned either. The reason we really sent that droid underwater, and the reason we needed its data back so badly, was to find out what happened to the Rackard Rift station. But now that we have the data back, our operation is in no danger of exposure to the Sith. And now I must live up to my end of the bargain. I took the liberty of having a submarine prepared for your departure. Merely use this card to get past the door behind our Colto packing room and enter the sub therein. It has been programmed to take you down to the station and also to take you back up should you need something. I would send soldiers to assist you, but we've lost many of ours and nearly exhausted the mercenary population of this planet. The soldiers we have are barely enough to keep this base secure. The Sith have also noted our interest and begun to bribe mercenaries away from us. Please, find out what happened to the facility. There may be some survivors left down there. Perhaps even the head scientist, Kono Nolan. Good luck in your efforts. How did you get in? Did they send another submersible? Quick, we have to get out of here. We have to get away. No! No, we have no time. We have to leave now. I managed to close the door after they killed everyone else, but I don't know how long it will hold. We have to. We have to leave. The cell cast, they went crazy. They started killing anything that moved. Someone must have triggered the defense systems too, because all the droids activated as well. I was one of the mercs the Republic sent down here to find out what happened. We came down and secured the first couple of rooms. There were bodies everywhere. And the Selkath came out, screaming and croaking their fishy little war cries. They swarmed out and over us. There was no way we could stop them. So we ran. But hardly any of us made it. I locked the door behind us, but... 
but the others had already left in the submersible. The sharks, the Faroxa out there, and worse. I heard an explosion shortly after the submersible left. They didn't make it just food for the sharks and the Silcath, like us. What? Wh no. You're one of them. You'll never get me!
Somebody out there? Fishy, fishy, fishy! <laughs> Come and eat me too! <laughs> you can't get me, little fishy! Nothing here! I'm safe behind my walls! Haha! <laughs> That's what you think? Fishy think that too! These walls and door are six centimeters, no twelve centimeters, of Durasteel! I'm invulnerable behind my walls! Nobody's getting in here! <laughs> Nothing can happen in here. No fishy food for me. No, 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 no. That's what the others said. Mercenaries like you. But they're dead. The Selkath ate them. Lunchy munchy. Only the ones left in the south part of the base might still be alive. But where the Kulto is, few fishies there. But many, many, many fishies in between the water. Bye-bye. Go look for fishy people. They'll chomp and bite and chomp and bite. Food for fishy. That's you. Is somebody out there? Ha! When this... No! You can't harm me in here. I'm invincible.
You're not Selkath, I can see that much. Are you another rescue crew? I'm a merc the Republic hired a couple days ago to investigate. But all we found was a bunch of insane Selkath killing everything that moves! All my companions are dead. The Selkath swarmed over us. There were dozens of them! And they... they looked... wrong... somehow. Like something had changed inside them. Insane or something! Oh, I'd have gone back to the surface long ago if this complex hadn't been overrun by all those crazy cell calves. There's no way for me to get to the submarine docking bay. I discovered a way to get to the bay and seal off the rest of the base. I just have to find the Colto Harvester they built on the edge of the Hracker Rift. It's got an emergency override to open the doors to the submarine docking bay. And I could get in from the outside. I figured my only chance was to slap on an environment suit, head out onto the ocean floor, and check that harvester out for myself. Besides, it's gotta be safer out on the ocean floor than back in there with all those crazed cell calf mutants running around looking for dinner! I'm not spending another minute in this facility. Not with those psychotic fish people all over the place! I'm heading out to the ocean floor right now. It leads to another complex of buildings. Going through them is the only way to reach the Colto Harvester. We should probably stick together, but I won't wait around in here with the cell calf. You can catch up with me if you want, down the hall and through the doors on the right. I'll be waiting on the ocean floor where it's safe.
Ah! <laughs> 